Water is the most important resource on the planet, but it's also extremely energy intensive. It takes a lot of energy to deliver water, and it takes a lot of water to deliver energy. I'm Greg Semler. I'm the CEO and founder of Impipe Energy. I started Impipe Energy because I got really excited about the potential to develop a new source of renewable energy from pressurized water pipelines. Several years ago, I started wondering about why don't we produce renewable energy from existing infrastructure? And what if we could produce energy that was consistent and reliable and predictable and had no environmental impact and was low cost? We can and we have. Impipe Energy has developed a system that recovers wasted pressure in the conveyance of water to produce a new source of renewable energy. So the Hydro Excess Energy Recovery System is a microhydro turbine coupled with a control valve that takes the excess pressure in a water system and converts it into clean, renewable energy. So there's three critical industries um, that we see potential for energy in water infrastructure. That would be municipalities, that would be agricultural, and that would be industrial. Across the industries, there are countless valves that historically their function was to reduce pressure. And now, with this technology, they can reduce pressure and generate energy. It's a value add at no risk to anyone that's installing a new pressure regulating valve. This technology is, is very scalable. It goes from all the way from very low flows, even as low as hundreds of GPM, up to tens of thousands of GPMs, gallons per minute. We have a process that we can integrate the hydro excess into existing pressure pipelines without even turning the water off. The same technology can be used in new construction. In new construction, it's even easier because we've designed the hydro excess to be as easy to purchase as a control valve. The hydro excess addresses really two really important areas, renewable energy and water loss control. And so what you see is that the convergence of concerns on the planet around energy and renewable energy, and the concerns around water loss and safe, clean drinking water in the event of climate change and climate disruption are coming together. When the hydro excess is in place, our customers can generate a new revenue stream from energy. They can reduce their carbon footprint. They can save water. They can extend the life of their infrastructure and they can do it all without changing what they're currently doing. What could be more sustainable?